I've been on a quest to find the perfect audio cable for this setup. We've got this Boyo microphone to the M50. It's a certain length. And this specific cable is the best one yet. This is a Boya MM1 microphone. They're not super great quality wise with the audio, but I'm no expert, so I just use what works. This one came with the Boya microphone. It's got a nice kind of springy action to it, but it's very long. What I can do sometimes is wrap it around this red part of the microphone connection. And that works okay, but the negative here is it has a normal connection on one end that's straight, so it either is gonna pop out of the microphone or pop out of the Side. It's just not ideal. My other attempt is this very small one, Ripu 3.5 millimeter auxiliary audio cable. Super thin, it's convenient, but the negative is that with the connection itself, it comes out straight right from there. And the strap lug on the M50 is an issue on this end where the microphone goes into the camera. What can happen is that this can rotate and it basically comes out. It's just not a good design for the specific camera. Came as a two pack, this is not an issue in this case. It's not gonna come out and it's flush. I like this cable with this setup. And just generally quality wise, I don't see any issues as far as I can tell. And they are pretty unique, pretty custom, super thin, easy to use. If your case is different than mine, these are just fine probably. One thing I learned with the M50, you might have seen another video about audio levels is that you wanna check them before you start recording. There's always an issue potentially with the connection from the microphone to the camera. The worst one that I've found so far are the Sinlun ones. See, it's very similar to this one. It's longer, of course, but the negative is there's some weird thing about these connections that make it very easy to mess it up with this specific microphone. Maybe your stuff would work better, but I have noticed also these feel a little looser than the other ones. So just in general, I'm not a fan of this cable. The length is okay because I can wrap it once and that works just fine, but I don't trust these at all with the audio. Now you can check your levels, of course. Maybe it'll depend on your specific case, but I would not go for these ones. Just nope. That works okay, it seems like, but it's never gonna change with this microphone. That's the main issue with how this connects to the microphone. The Sinlun one did come as a two pack, which I guess value, but if it doesn't work, then there's no value to it. When you're trying to do things like this, the main goal is to get the gear out of the way so you can make a story or make a video. And if your gear is causing you problems, causing you troubles, making it harder to do things, then you definitely want to look for something that works better. The ones that I like the best so far are these Valley Enterprises ones. It appears to be working pretty nicely. I don't have any issues with the connection so far. They come as a single pack, so they're pretty pricey when you consider. Some of them came as a two pack which was nice, but if they're not gonna work, they're not gonna work. So in this case, I would not use this one that I like with this setup. In this case, with the phone flipped around, I'm gonna have that down there, but then the selfie screen will be over here. It could work just fine. I haven't noticed any issues with the connections, which is one of the big things. And it's relatively short. One negative is that I can't wrap it around the connection here from the microphone to the camera because it is too short but in general these are my currently most perfect unless there are issues i find later on audio cable for my vlogging setup with the boyo microphone in the m50 little things like this make a big difference in my opinion with being efficient not having issues making sure your stuff just works how it needs to work to get what you're trying to do accomplished so with simple things like audio cables my budget is mostly zero for all of this stuff a lot of the time, but I will spend some money on things like this to really improve little bits and pieces here and there to get in stuff working easier and better. I'm Scott from Tarvi Bonsai. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider subscribing. That helps me out a lot. Likes and shares help out a lot as well. Thanks again.